There we go. So Deuce, just give me um, your, your thoughts. I mean, obviously it was, it was a battle for about 30 minutes. What was the difference in the last 10? Uh, defense, honestly. Uh, we locked in as a team. I think we were leaving guys on the islands and they were coming off screens easy, taking easy shots to good players. And in the Big East, they know how to play. And I think once we uh, locked in as a team, you know, we took some of that stuff away and they got one shot. We rebounded and uh, got out in transition. Next is Cody Nesper. Uh, Deuce, it seemed like um, the, the energy and the team really kind of flipped around after your three-pointer in the second half. Did you feel that? And, and just what kind, of, what kind of difference does a shot like that make? Um, I think, you know, you know, I think none of us have shot the ball the way we wanted to. And I think anytime you see uh, the ball go in the hoop, everybody feeds off it, you know. We started chairing the ball and we're doing it the right way. So I think, you know, we're a great team. We love each other and, you know, we support one another. So when one guy makes a shot, it's like we're all making a shot. So it's things like that. Go ahead, Justin Jackson. Hey, Deuce, uh, the game is tied at uh, 60 with, uh, you know, whatever, six and a half left to go. Uh, two key moments, I thought, uh, when you dove on the floor and then got kind of tied up there and, and I think you maybe bounced your, your, your lip off the floor maybe. But, but then you, know, you, you forced – you know, you came back to force the turnover and then you guys go back down and, and Emmett gets the, uh, the, the big dunk. Uh, uh, those, those two moments, uh, how, how key were they in the game and, you know, what was it like to, to be in on that possession? Uh, you know, it's amazing. I think, like I said, when – when the game comes down to defense, <laughs> when the game huh? the game comes down to that defense. Came out of your mouth. <laughs> I was saying we're not playing any defense, uh, but <laughs> when the game's coming down to defense, I think uh, we know that's going to be you know what we have to go to. If we're not making shots, we got to go to defense. And being in a possession like that, it's just going to create even more energy, especially when you know we see a guy like Emmett fly up like that through the air and get a dunk. Go to Kevin Kinder. Deuce, following up on Justin's question, there's been a lot of discussion about the improvement in your game, how much you've worked over the offseason. How do you work on defense? You know, what are the kind of things that you did that are making you a better defensive player? Uh, honestly, it starts with our uh, strength host, Sean Brown. I mean, we start every day with doing stuff like uh, moving our feet, you know, defensive slides, and just doing that, you know, through the whole time we were waiting for the season to start. And then, it, again, it's about effort and wanting to play defense and wanting to, you know, stay in a stance and take some pride in stopping your man. Go ahead, Greg. So, Deuce, Derek had to be pretty, uh, you know, uh, upset early with all the foul trouble and that limited him. What kind of energy did he give you in the second half when he was able to finally stay on the floor? Well, I mean, you know, their bigs, they, they played well, you know. But I, again, I think we have two of the best bigs in America. You know, when, when Oscar and Derek are, are playing like we know and we see every day, you know, through practice, it, it's hard to stop them. man. obviously, when they're controlling the paint, it makes it a playing on the perimeter a lot easier. And back to Justin. Hey, Deuce, uh, this is obviously uh, the fifth game uh, you guys have played away from home to start the season. Uh, I'm just kind of wondering, what's it like uh, going on the road uh, with this team? And, uh, you know, are these games, you know, obviously there's not going to be any fans for home games. So, I mean, are these games any different uh, on the road as, uh, as a home game? Yeah, definitely. You know, uh, shoot, we're used to, you know, a game like this probably been 10,000 10, people here. And I think, you know, for guys returning, we're used to that. You know, we kind of we kind of go off of the energy of the crowd, you know, so – it's tough to not have that, but again, you know, we're college basketball players, you know, things are going to happen, things aren't going to go our way, so we got to find a way to, to get through it and create our own energy off the bench. You know, guys are standing up. Freshman uh, Tosh Thweet, you know, he's yelling, he's up and out of his chair, you know, so it's things like that. We're just creating energy ourselves. And final question for Miles is uh, Skylar Callahan. Hey, dude, sorry I hopped on late, so I'm sorry if you've already been asked this, but uh, Coach Hugg said the other day that you guys needed to have more ball movement, more passes, uh, to have more success on offense. Do you feel like you got that out of your guys today? Yeah, I think when it came down to the, the crunch time, I think we did, you know, early. I think guys were coming out and we were, you know, 
decent shots, but obviously, you know, coach wants us to get the better shot. And I think that's what we have to do as a team and grow together and, you know, figure out how to get our guys that can make shots in the ball efficiently and uh, quickly. So that's pretty much all I have to say on that.